Hello, in this video we will be seeing how you can generate iOS screenshots for App Store. So screenshots are the first impression that your app gives to your customers and plays an important role. So uh, when you upload uh, your app into App Store, uh, the first look is always given by the app. So uh, this needs to be entered by the uh, owner and here you require an app preview and screenshots. So app previews are basically the uh, video or uh, the screen recording or whichever uh, that's relevant to your app. And also it requires uh, 10 screenshots, almost 10 screenshots uh, altogether. So uh, there are four uh, special categories. First one is the iOS uh, 6 inch display, which uh, basically is the I uh, iPhone. Uh, 6s and then uh, iPhone 10x or X uh, then there is iPhone uh, 6s and then there is iPad Pro 3 gen and then there is iPod iPad Pro 2 uh, second gen so these are the uh, screenshots that you need to re uh, require or upload into uh, App Store so uh, we'll be seeing how you can generate this so for that we're going to go to our website and here you have this iOS app ready in your, the app maker dashboard. You can just click on to the preview and a bundle will be available right here. So you can just download the app file. So, so this will be coming up in a dot zip file. Now you need to go to the appetize.io upload. You can just click on to the link uh, right here and uh, you can download the uh, upload the zip file that you have just uh, downloaded uh, I'm, I'm just going to uh, sell, give the file right here so uh, our zip file will be uploaded and then you need to enter your uh, mail address and uh, click on generate so once uh, the uh, file is generated you will be receiving a link you can just click on to that and uh, rightly go to the appetize dot uh, page so I have received the link uh, to the app preview so I'm just going to click on to that and then uh, we're taken into this page where you can see your app in uh, proper form how you uh, are you will be able to see it in uh, iOS device so when you just click on to tap the app will be loading and you will get the app and here are the views of the app like there is success uh, like all of the device uh, will be right here so this will this is my app that just created then when you click on to allow this is the proper app that you will be able to view so uh, we need uh, four devices first one a success so first we'll just uh, download the success file so this is a first preview i'm just going to save the screenshot and the screenshot will be saved right here then uh, you can uh, go on and click on to the screenshots that you need uh, for your uh, like whichever page that you have so i'm going to save a screenshot of the menu right here then uh, i'm going to uh, click on to a product right here i'm just going to click on to this product and i'll uh, save the screenshot then i'm going to add to the add this product to cart and uh, get a screenshot of this as well so uh, i i'm just uh, taking four screenshots as of now so uh, after i uh, down, uh, get the screenshot what you need to do is you need to go to app maker tools so you can just search for app maker tools post the link in the description so it's the tools.appmaker.xyz and here you will be able to see different uh, assets for play store assets the app store assets and some other banner and grid maker asset for the app maker so i'm just going to click on to the app store asset right here and you will be taken into this design tool where you can uh, upload the file so uh, when you just click on to the show mandatory option uh, only the mandatory uh, ios files are available so first uh, we have just downloaded the uh, 5 inch display 5.5 inch display and here you need to uh, add the screenshot right uh, over here so you can just choose the screenshot so i'm just going to choose uh, add the screenshot right uh, up here and the uh, image will be right uh, down here so you can just download the image and uh, similarly you can add uh, all of the images and uh, download the previews 
just like I'm doing right now and here you need to download the image then uh, again you can go back and here you can choose for the 10x so you can just click on to the 10x and tap to play so the 10x view will, uh, will also be avail available so i'm going to save the screenshots again of the similar in the similar fashion a home screen uh, menu, uh, menu option then uh, i'll have uh, the product option right here and i'll save the screenshot and similarly i'll repeat the same step uh, i'll go to the uh, product uh, productivity tool our tool and then uh, go to this 10 uh, iphone x display and then again uh, choose the file and uh, download the image so uh, you need to do uh, 6s right here 10x then we have the i uh, ipad air ipad air 2 so these are the uh, these are the four screenshot that you need to generate so total uh, you need like four 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 and uh, you will be needing uh, almost 12 screenshots but it's uh, you can add as much as screenshot uh, 10 maximum of 10 is uh, available so that's how you can uh, create this uh, generate the app uh, generate the app screenshot and also uh, for app maker also uh, comes with a uh, like logo creator right here so you need to upload the logo in certain uh, in the certain size so you can just go to this here and create the logo you can just upload the logo and it will come in a high resolution uh, uh, size that you need for your app store upload so uh, that's how you can generate all of the uh, screenshots and logos for your apps to ios upload